Our final story tonight is about a major change coming to India schools, not in the syllabus, but in how children learn to think. CBSE has drafted a new curriculum on artificial intelligence. CBSE is the Central Board of Secondary Education, and it has now prepared a draft framework for AI in schools. The new plan brings basic AI and computational thinking into early classes. We're talking about children starting as early as, as the third class. And it goes up all the way to class 12. The rollout is expected to begin next year. NCERT, that's the National Council for Educational Research, is now reviewing the draft before a national rollout. But here's the question. Can India scale this plan in a way that keeps teachers ready and classrooms equipped? Here's our report. Indian schools may soon bring artificial intelligence into everyday lessons. CBSE, or the Central Board of Secondary Education, has drafted a new AI and computational thinking curriculum. It spans classes 3 to 12. Parts of the plan are expected to begin from the 2026 to 2027 academic year. The draft outlines how AI will enter classrooms in a phased and structured way. A panel of experts is being set up to study the document. The plan aligns with the National Education Policy 2020. It also aligns with the National Curriculum Framework for School Education 2023. Officials call this a nascent but significant step. The aim is to reinforce learning, thinking, and teaching. The framework uses the idea of AI for public good. The structure begins early. For classes three to five, computational thinking will be embedded in subjects like language, maths, and environmental studies. For classes six to eight, students will be introduced to foundational AI concepts. Assessments will include projects and presentations. Handbooks and worksheets will support these grades. In classes nine and 10, advanced computational thinking and intermediate AI are set to become compulsory subjects. In classes 11 and 12, Core AI and machine learning concepts will be offered as electives. Teacher preparation is one of the focuses of the draft. Learning material, teacher guides, and digital content are expected by December this year. Teacher training will run through national programs and recognized institutions. Reports say maths and subject teachers will handle younger classes. Different teachers will reportedly work together in the middle grades. Computer science teachers may lead senior classes. The draft has now been sent to the NCERT, or the National Council for Educational Research and Training, for expert review, but rolling out will not be that easy. India reportedly has about 1.5 million schools. It has more than 248 million students and reportedly over 10.1 million teachers. While not all schools are aligned to CBSE, a system this large comes with natural challenges. Many schools still lack basic digital infrastructure. The country continues to face a persistent digital divide. Device access and connectivity vary widely across regions. Training teachers will also take time, especially for those new to AI tools. These hurdles are part of the transition, and countries worldwide are navigating similar shifts. The UAE, China, and Finland, among others, are also introducing AI into their schools. India is now working to develop its own model. The aim is to find an approach that fits its classrooms and its scale. The draft offers the first outline of that path, and the next few months will show how quickly India can move from plan to practice. Wonder facts? The latest developments? News that gets straight to the point. Well, we've got all three just for you. This is First Post Live, a brand new show. Your window into what really matters. Don't miss it.